kind of curious who's all keeping up with what the hell's uh, little adventures in Otter Creek. Uh, I love what the hell's and I want to do a little video about this. Hey everyone, just doing a little video on what the hell's. I don't know if any of you guys are following the uh, episodes lately on how the town of Otter Creek is so corrupt. Uh, I've been watching What the Hales for oh, a couple years now and I just love their videos. Uh, but I'd kind of like to know what everybody else thinks about the town of Otter Creek and the way they're handling their business. To me it seems like George and Jeremy just want to help everybody in the community but the city is just fighting against them all the way and I, I really don't understand it other than the, the corruption that's there uh, and I, I don't really don't even know if it's corruption or just ignorance uh, obviously the city is not being run fiscally responsible and like Jeremy said, they're just pulling numbers out of the hat because they're going broke. But uh, Jeremy, and he just seems like he cares about the community. He cares about people. He's, he's a very Christian man, and I've never seen anything that he wouldn't help somebody if they're honest and true and just being good people. I mean, I've never met the Hales, but from the videos that I've seen, the events that they did at the half mill time to grill, they, they're they just very Christian giving people. And I don't understand why the city of, of the town of Otter Creek is fighting them against this. All he wants is to be treated fair and let me know what you guys think about this. Do you think that Jeremy's pursuing this a little too hard or is the city just that ignorant that they they can't see a good thing when it's on their doorstep? Uh, I'm, I'm really curious about this. Like I say, I've watched What the Hales for a couple of years now. I enjoy their videos. Uh, Christian and Patience and George and Jeremy they they're just they just seem like wonderful people and I would be honored to work with somebody like that. I mean it, it's just crazy that people in Otter Creek would fight them on something as simple as a, a, ripping them off on their water bill and Jeremy's right that is theft no matter which way you look at it if the city is actually having financial troubles, then do something to correct that. I mean, if, if I was in the city of Otter Creek and had water as nasty as theirs is, I wouldn't even have their city water. <laughs> I mean, it, it's just, just crazy. You're paying for water that you can't drink. I wouldn't even bathe in that stuff alone and drink it. So, yeah, just let me know what you guys feel about this. Uh, I, I just, like I say, I'm, I'm with Jeremy 100% on, on the, the way that the town of Otter Creek is treating him. I mean, he just wants accountability. And they're just, they're not very accountable. I mean, that's just the way it is. So, it, to me, it just goes to show you that corruption is not just in big government it's it's even in small government so yeah let me know your opinion on this I, i'm really interested in it uh i never missed what the hell's videos so yeah just tell me what you think whether you think that jeremy's wrong or the city is wrong uh, i'm really curious and uh thanks again for supporting my channel 
I definitely appreciate you all. And God bless you. And we'll talk to you later.